Alright guys, welcome back to Let's Play Sonic and the Secret Ring. So in the last episode, we went down here and we fought the pirate guy who was honestly no match for us at all. And then we went here, we are doing the Die Hard Challenge. Don't get defeated, it's not that hard, normally. I've had some situations where it's actually harder than that, but you know. Uh, I only have 10 available to me. What? Oh, okay, yeah. I could use 8 on this. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm gonna do that. Yeah, I think that's all I can do. So let's do this. Oh no, this music. I forgot about this. I already got a fire soul. Okay. Wait. There was a fire soul crushed by that. So it's either go fast or miss out. Ah, that's so Super Mario Brothers. Need to get some rings. Did they just drop a bomb on top of another bomb to trick me? Like, oh, I can hit that bomb with those enemies. Nope, it blows up. You know, I forgot that was there. I know I've done that before. Come on. Hey, 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 I didn't equip the back stuff, dang it, there we go, I didn't, but I got the silver thing, which was right on top of it. Whatever. That upsets me. Come on, go faster. What? What did I get hit by? Almost forgot again. And that was an easy mission. Got the metal on it. That's nice. I still have to replay it for the Fire Soul, but... Eh. I'm a little bit bitter about that. New page obtained. New missions. Yep. Missions. That was good. Two of them. Sorry to keep you waiting. <laughs> I didn't mean to leave you hanging earlier. You're not still mad at me, are you? You really need to learn to be more patient, you know? Now, ring of water, bring forth a mighty storm. Wait, I just I just realized a plot hole. If Sonic's the only one who can touch the world rings, then why could uh, Sinbad? Look, the Ifrit is getting weaker. Okay, now let's finish him off. I just realized that. Sinbad, he totally, he totally said he used to use that ring until it was stolen by the pirates. So, how the butt did that happen? Okay, well, hands off, finished with zero rings. Let's do it. Three, two, one. 
I'll take a ring right there. Okay, the goal is right there, so I need to back up here and get hit. Guys, you here? There you are. Now that I've got hit. No. God. No, come on. Let's try this again. There we go. No, no. Hey, hey, game. Stop the crap. While I'm here, I'm just gonna grab all this. Alright. Since I'm here, make it easier just to walk through it all. I know this isn't exactly the recommended way to do this, but honestly, I'm doing things the cheap way. I know you're supposed to sprint. I don't care. And we're done. That's how you get to the core. With no rings. Mission completed. I totally did that legit. <laughs> you can't prove otherwise. And got the level up I wanted. Super quick air. Allows you to fly more smoothly than with quick air. Alright, well, we didn't get any new missions off that, so defeat the boss is the only mission available to us. So we're going into another boss battle. Sweet. Customize the skill ring real quick, since I have seven. Uh, I would need one more there. All right, I have 17 to work with here. Now I have five to work with. Uh, yeah, sure, why not? I haven't used it before, I might like it. Actually, wait, 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 I just realized something. Customize the skill ring. How do I... Oh, that's what it is. I just wanted to see what that did. gonna go that direction. Fine, we're just gonna meet up in the middle here. This is a water ring. And I'm gonna lie. Game. Come on, stopping such a butt. Ow. Oh, come on. And it went to the other side because I missed it. The 
Ow. That is not water. I hope you know that. Okay, really? So, we're in lava that it not only starts... This fight is interesting. Okay, I just need to dodge it until she suggests, I think. Okay, actually, we're. The water level in the furnace rises. Come on, further. That's it. You found its weak point. Yep, hit it twice even. Oh, come on. Actually, I just realized something that would be incredibly helpful. Actually, that's not helpful at all because I forgot it doesn't actually speed me up any. Which automatically hits me down. Alright. I don't think the Sonic team knows how gravity works because I was just walking up a 90 degree slope. Down again. I have no rings left, so hopefully this beats them. Nope. Then I could die here. Especially when Sonic decides he doesn't want to go after the rings. Uh... Oh, fantastic. I have no idea what spawns those things. Seriously, what's with all those random silver medallions? One, I don't understand this lock-in system at all. Lock-on system. No, I... I give up. I give up on this lock-on system. It sucks. On. I'm so far into this, I don't want to die. Seriously, this this ability actually kind of bothers the crap out of me. Hey, 
And now I'm restarting it. Because he can shoot right in front of me. As I'm landing. No, I... I was locked on! I give up. Maybe I have to get his attention first? I have to get in front of him and then back up? I was locked on! That's not even the one I was locked on to. Oh my bejesus. Come on. On. You found its uh, this is actually quite annoying. Haha! Like -ha. Got hit off. Maybe you should try attacking that hands holding up its body. I don't understand why the little uh Soul orb things get sucked into the lava. They're on solid platforms. Ah, gotcha three times with that one. Seems mad, he's throwing up fire and whatnot. No, I. I was locked on. God. The walk on in this game is almost as bad as freaking... You know what? The tank out of freaking uh, Red vs. Blue. For any of you who've seen that show. That's in season one, episode four or five or something. Let's just say there's a team killer in that show. Yeah, ow. He didn't do that last time, so, oh. Oh. Okay, that is a dick move. I just have to dodge all the explosives. I can do this. Okay, I just have to go all the way around. Come on. And it didn't let me attack it. Come on. Oh, come on. Okay, I need to head around this side. Okay, never mind. Hey, he's doing it again already. Uh, this boss battle is... Okay. Get 
Gotcha. Also, I could have jumped up the other side from there. Oh, well. Let's just walk up. Gotcha. Ifrit, down. No, Ifrit's not down. Ow. No, I wasn't trying to walk... You know what? Never mind. What am I expecting? It's this game. Nope. <sighs> Come on. Uh... I went through it. You know what? <sighs> Come on. I'm sorry I'm so quiet, guys. This is just taking all of my focus. I'm tired tonight, and honestly, this game is not being kind. This is obviously the last one. I say obvi obviously because, honestly, she hadn't spoken on any of the others. Except for after the second last one. Gotcha. Ifrit, boom. I don't know why this thing was considered a Jin. It was a robot, but okay. Uh, mission complete. That took six minutes. Action bonus of 1665. Enemy bonus. Ring bonus. Whew, wow. That was interesting. It was challenging. I'll say that much. Fast grind. Increases acceleration more than with quick, quick grind. Obtained a page, obtained missions, even possibly a new world? Nah, I would have said new world already. Oh, hey, it's another one of those things. What is this thing? Is something about to hatch? Eggs, how do they work? Hear, I can hear something like a heartbeat. Uh, Shara? I think that might be some sort of time bomb. It's beating faster. Oh no, this can't be good. We've got to get out of here. This thing has to explode out in the open. You're right. It's, how would you know it was a time bomb? Because I would have assumed it was the heart of Ifrit. So guys, next time let's play Sonic and the Secret Rings. We're going to be going to the Evil Foundry and trying to get rid of this bomb because we are about to die if we are not careful. Beat the clock. Find the exit in time. So guys, see you next time.